Hello, good morning. Uh, my name is Leonardo Vizzetto, as uh, Chelsea said. Uh, I'm a sophomore. I'm studying chemical engineering in the College of Science and Engineering. And uh, first of all, you know, first things first, I'd like to congratulate all of you. Uh, not only were you accepted to a prestigious university, but you also earned a very competitive scholarship. So congratulations to you all. Uh, and oftentimes, I say this because oftentimes it's easy for us to get wrapped up in just what lies ahead, all the challenges that we're going to have to face, uh, the excitement of first semester on campus, and sometimes that kind of clouds uh, the size of the accomplishment that you already had. So take a step back, you know, take a deep breath, and let it sink in that you, from whatever country you came from, from whatever adversities you dealt with, uh, for whatever path took you to here, that you're here, that you ended up here at the University of Minnesota, and that you were granted a scholarship. You made it, and in fact, you made it so well that the University of Minnesota gave you a scholarship. You know, so you know that's a pretty big deal. Uh, that scholarship, of course, it's great. It's financial help. It helps a lot to ease uh, the cost cost of tuition. But uh, most importantly, what you should carry from that, and what I try to carry from that, is that the University of Minnesota really, really trusts your capacity as students and trusts that you can do well and, and excel in, the, uh, in your courses and the courses that you take. So uh, I'm saying all of this, and I don't mean to just give you guys an ego boost. That's not the point here. Uh, but the reason I'm saying this is not for right now, First semester is okay. Second semester is okay. It's for when it gets tough later on, for when it gets harder, for when your classes get more intense, uh, for when you, you start wondering if you made the right decision, if your major is too hard, if you switch majors. Uh, all of that is okay, but when you, you feel that pressure on you, just remember that you're here, the university reviewed your application, and they thought you had what it takes to excel in, in the program that you chose and that you deserve a scholarship to be here. So if you don't, if you get those moments where you kind of waver a little bit, at least you know the University of Minnesota really trusts you. So that's always great. And so what the message I'm trying to give you guys is trust yourselves. If you're here, if you're accepted, if you got that scholarship, you can do it. All right? You made it, you have the talent to do it. What you might lack right now is the motivation to put in the hours and put in the work to get the most out of that talent. That's what I'm trying to give you guys here. You can do it, but you gotta put the work in. It's hard. There are 2 a.m. study sessions and whatever, you know, that happens. But, you know, you gotta do it. Uh, you gotta extract the most out of that talent, because talent without work, without you putting effort in, is useless. So, that's, that's the message I'm trying to give you guys. And what I wanna say is, take this opportunity that all of you rightfully earned, because all of you have what it takes to be here, and do the best you can with it. You know, take the most out of the resources that you have here at the university. So go to the libraries, go to the computer labs, go to the rec center, join an intramural basketball team, volleyball team, whatever you want. Uh, join a student group, uh, go to the career center, go to the career fairs, go to the writing center. Take advantage of everything you have here. Go to parties, go have fun with your friends, um, <laughs> you know, meet people. And most importantly, like the most important thing you should get out of this is try every day a little bit to do something to make these four years that you're here memorable for the rest of your lives. So that's what I try to want to instill in you guys. So thank you.